Hi everybody today i will show you how to reset website in wordpress so let's just begin okay so how can we reset our website so for that we need to install a plugin here so i will go into the plugins and add the new plugin and from here i actually have to search for the wp reset and you will be able to see the wp reset the most advanced wordpress reset tool by web factory limited so let's install this wp reset resets the entire website or the selected part of the website using the advanced reset options to the default value okay so now let's activate our plugin here okay so we got the message from the wp reset that thanks for installing the wp reset plugin etc so let's dismiss this all right so what we need to do here as you can see our wp reset plugin is activated so now we will actually go into the reset tools here so let's just click here and we will be inside the wp reset plugin as you can see the different packages for the wp reset here so let's just close this okay so here uh, as you can see we have the option reset which is actually the pro tool and we also have the nuclear reset which is also the pro tool uh, but we have the site reset which is actually included in the free version okay so what can we delete with the site reset we can actually delete the post pages and the custom post types uh, the comments the media and the users and the user roles and we can also delete the widgets uh, transients settings and the options from the wp plugins and the theme and we will also delete the data in all the default wp table and the custom database table with the wp prefixes Okay, so these are the things that we can delete or reset with the help of WP Reset plugin here since we are using the free version only. But if you are using the nuclear reset, you can actually customize this even more here. All right. Okay, so what will happen when I run any reset tool here? Okay, so first of all, the first thing is that we have to create the backup uh, before doing the reset of our website. We can use the snapshots. Uh, you will have to confirm the action one more time okay uh, you will see the table above to find out what exactly will be reset or deleted so since we are using the free version whatever we have here in the site reset will be deleted okay that we have discussed earlier and the site title wordpress url uh, site url language search engine visibility and the current user will always be restored all right and i will be logged out automatically logged back and tech into the admin dashboard okay and wp reset plugin will be reactivated if that option is chosen one more thing here that we cannot delete the themes and the plugins with the wp reset okay so themes and the plugins will be uh, deactivated uh, but it won't delete the plugins and the themes okay as you can see here the option reset here which is actually the pro tool so we will simply skip this and we have the site reset so in the site reset if i want to reactivate the current theme which is astro so i can simply check here but if i don't want to reactivate this uh, i will simply skip this okay so reactivate the wp reset plugin okay so that is checked and if i want to reactivate all currently active plugins i will simply check this but right now i don't want to reactivate all of these plugins here okay so now what we need to do to reset our website here I will simply write down the reset here and it would actually reset our website but before that let me just show you the number of the pages in the post that we have in our website so you can actually see that we really resetted our website okay so let's go back here and go back into the post we actually have the three posts here now let's go into the pages and we have these multiple pages all of things will be deleted from here and the post and also the comments and also into the other options so now let's go back into the tools and from here we can actually go into the w series head so now what you need to do let's just write down the reset here so this will actually reset our website in the wordpress so let's click on the reset side all right so yes i am actually sure about this so click on the reset wordpress and this would actually reset our website here all right so as you can see here we actually resetted our website and if i go into the post you will be able to see only the hello world here because that is the default post of the wordpress and if i go into the pages 
you will only see the two pages here these are the default pages of the wordpress okay so now let's just go back to our website and you can see that we don't have anything on our website so we have completely resetted our website here so if i go into the plugins you will be able to see all the plugins here the thing is wp reset plugin only deactivated all the plugins here and if i go into the appearance we will have all the themes that i have already installed but the default theme of the WP Reset plugin whenever we reset our website is actually the 2023. So that is why we have this theme. Alright, so this is how it is done and this is how we can reset our website in the WordPress. And if you really find this video useful, hit the like button and subscribe the channel.